Okay, so suppose you, uh, you, you want to put a trend line in here. Um, you already have your graph from uh, homework number one. It's actually not too hard to um, update your graph. So what, what do we do? Well, uh, go to this little pull-down menu. Go to Advanced Edit. And uh, then you go down to the bottom here. I always forget. Here it is. The very bottom says trend line. We don't want none. So we're going to click linear. We want a linear trend line. And you can't quite see it. it's off camera, but I'll show you in a second. And then under data labels, what do we want? Uh, oh, actually a little lower here. On a label, uh, instead of custom, what use equation. You can show R squared if you want. It doesn't really matter for our sake. Um, and then that will do it. Click update. And now you can see uh, what's going on here. So it, it's a little uh, hard to read potentially. So, you know, what you ought to be getting, and you'll have to do it on your own, you need your graph, but it's y equals 1.537x minus 2702.359. That's how you would read that value off. Okay? And that's the equation you'll need to use.